Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration um, reading for the Aquarian Sun, Moon and Rising for the coming week. And this is going to be a week of the Hermit. It's the number nine energies. It's a wonderful week when the inner wisdom, awareness, consciousness, connection uh, with the unseen world, um, but yet still connecting with your mighty I Am Present Self. It's a week of blue, it's a week of healing, it's a week of speaking the truth, it's a week of connecting with your galactic and families. So this is going to be the last week of June 2017 and it's going to be the week number 26 and the week will begin from the 26th until the 2nd of July. So this is going to be wonderful. As we look at this week and the aspect in this week, um, the number nine energies also carry the energy vibration of spirituality, spirituality or the connection of the spiritual beams that you connect with and your guides. Um, so the energy vibration of a lot of inter intergalactic beings uh, will be trying to connect with you. And as we move out, of this last week into the month of July which is going to be more um, your psychic and everything is going to be extremely high for you um, Aquarians water sign because you're also vibrating in your own um, the um, hair and water okay so this is the energy vibration uh, this week is the energy vibration of a water week but yet still is the zodiac energy of water uh, of water and you are a air sign so be aware of uh, um, expect the unexpected it's going to be a week where healing and transformation but yet still expect the energy of the unexpected it's like changes are coming in um, you're going to feel differently um, it's it's a week where spirituality is going to be a high energy vibration uh, it's um, uh, the week of water and also the zodiac of water so you Aquarians uh, um, it's an echinacean week it's an healing week so this is a, a very 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 um, spiritual week for you guys which is not so bad since it's you're an air sign number four is a very very important angels and guides or <clears throat> Are opening up the energy of the angels or guides in here or here opening up so um, <clears throat> be aware of the situation whatsoever is going on the angels and guides are here the number four you have three times number four in this week okay um, um, what else is here for you Aquarians the ace of cups with the the Ten of Cups is also good. So whatever your family situation is, it's going to be a profound good one. Thursday is going to celebrate something of a family. So maybe um, you're coming together with family members and that sort of a thing. But the universe is going to bring an healing to your family situation on Wednesday. This is what I am receiving for you guys on Wednesday. Whatever is going on, you have a strong foundation to build up on your financial situation. You have a strong foundation that you're going to build on. What's to ever that has been stolen or lost, it's going to be returned to you. Uh, Thursday is going to be a positive, wonderful time and a day where you're going to um, see and realize uh, how very special certain things and certain aspects are. The healing in a family is going to be profoundly um, good um another wonderful energy that is here because the number seven is also here um, twice seven seven and seventy and three times four is here and it's very important because the angels and guides are saying that you're on the right part in your life whatever you're doing as we look at um, the energy vibration here we have um, the seven of cups which is seven of cups is a new opportunities are opening up new doors of opportunities are opening up and with that the world is going to open up to you okay I'm sorry I'm always forget the north my hair so um um, yeah new doors of opportunities are going to open so um, the end of something is going to happen and new doors of opportunities are going to open up okay so 
and any more messages are here there's an energy with uh, um, 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 people who are in relationship um, it's like um, negative energies or should should I say that people who are jealous of you um, be aware of these sort of a people because uh, um, people will pretend as if they're happy for you in your relationship and uh, um, there's a lot of jealousy that is coming in so be aware of certain people certain aspect uh, um, remember if you are a light worker remember that um, you work with people and then you leave their energies out there okay uh, um, it's best as a light worker for the time being you connect with people just um, to um, connect with them but at the same time protecting yourself because um, for whosoever who are um, psychic and that sort of a thing be aware of what is happening around you because uh, um, when you open up your energy to somebody else you need to close off your energies okay and you need to do this as we look at the energy on Monday you have the four of Pentacles the four of Pentacles is a wonderful energy and this four of Pentacles um, is bringing balance to your financial situation and whoever um, this person is for you whether it's affecting you in the masculine or um, the feminine aspect um, this is the energy vibration of an earth element which is good it is bringing balance into your life so on Monday it's going to be a balance a healing to your financial situation and this healing is going to be supporting you as someone who is of an earth energy um, vibration it's uh, the Taurus the Virgo or the Capricorn so you're going to either connect to this person or this person is going to make certain financials um, certain sort of a money available to you so it's going to happen to you guys in different ways it could be a supervisor it could be someone who is helping you out of an organization it could be someone who has been protecting you and who has been um, actually really trying to connect with you and that sort of a thing and you're realizing that this earth sign person is a bringing in financial help and balance to your financial situation which is extremely good it's going to be a hold a person um, it's going to be it can either be someone who has passed over to the spirit world or it can be um, an older person that is uh, coaching you along or or bringing you um, to a place where the the energies are um, flowing and up, up 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 a good way in your life. Okay, on Tuesday we have another four. We have the four of swords. The four of swords, which is another um, energy of uh, being taking rest, taking rest, and this is extremely good. And this energy and uh, by it's saying that during the time that you're taking rest um, in these two um, first days of the week you are you have a strong foundation so uh, some people will think okay I can't stop and I, I need to go uh, I need to um, build on this build on this take rest on Monday and Tuesday because um, um, even though you're going to take your going to be taking rest uh, you're still having a strong foundation so you have nothing to worry about so this is just going to be extremely positive for you in the light and the sense that whatever is coming in you still have a strong foundation so if you're taking time out on Monday and Tuesday um, everything will be in the divine perfect order okay so this is uh, this is a good message um, On Wednesday you have the seven of, of, of sword and the seven of swords is um, the end to um, the backstabbing the dishonesty that people have been throwing at you um, people's trying to get away with stuff and that sort of a thing there is going to come an end to this sort of a um, situation and uh, whatever that was stolen from you will be returned it will be returned okay so whatever that was stolen from you will be returned and this is extremely good so remember that whatsoever you are trying to do whatever that was stolen from you and the backstabbing the line and all that sort of a thing is now 
had an end it's coming to an end and you will realize that on Tuesday you have the energy the Thursday you have the energy of the ace of cups so this is this is another wonderful positive energies for you guys uh, this is a profoundly positive because um, what's the ever that was going on around you whatsoever lies that has been told this sort of a thing on um, uh, uh, th Thursday you are going to have uh, uh, the cups the ace of cups uh, and this is going to bring a wonderful healing to your family life so whatsoever that has been happening people have been lying and being misled and that sort of a thing you are going to see that a change is going to come in on Thursday and it's going to affect everyone's life it's um she this week as a week as of healing and cleansing and and this is going to bring positive beginnings because uh, on a friday you have another seven which is the seven of cups you have another seven which is the seven of cups and this is wonderful the seven of cups energy um is going to bring the world it's going to bring the end of a cycle to you the end of uh, things and new beginnings are going to come in um, um the, this 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 sort of a situation is going to bring positive positive energy in and then you are going to see such a wonderful powerful um situation coming in your life and rolling in your life and this seven of cups are going the doors of opportunities are going to open up so on fridays you know expect that uh, um, wonderful things are going to roll in your life uh, uh, things that you weren't expecting are going to just uh, um, positively come in your life because the love of healing this huge healing of love came in on um, Thursday and on Friday you're going to see a perform change in your life the weekend as the balance of another water and fire water and fire water and fire let me get my glasses water and fire or water yeah water and fire so this is this is good as another the weekend is going to be another cleansing so this is going to be positive because what is happening in the weekend is that um and the lovers will be overcoming their enemies okay so you have people who have been um, um, you know who, who have been uh, being very and uh, not so nice they pretend as if they they are nice and they pretend as if they're happy with what has been going on with your partnership but you come to realize that that wasn't true okay because um, this is all about the love in this week because uh, whatsoever that has been happening in your life you are realize and you're seeing that um the people who you thought uh, were uh, nice they're not really nice and sometimes people say that they're not nice and they're just telling you to be aware of them because uh, you know they can go and shift their energy uh, to something so whatsoever was happening the energy and I've been seeing this the last month that the energy of uh, um, the the your people who you weren't aware of that is uh, a bit, you know backstabbing or um, working against you that sort of an energy is coming out for you guys on Saturdays so it's as if you guys went out or people saw you guys or you know a connection with you guys and uh, uh, it's, it's, it's a sort of backstabbing that is going on which is not really nice and not really positive okay as we um, go forward we have the energy of the six of ones and this is good because the six of one energy is bringing good news to you so whatsoever has been happening in your life on Sunday um, good news is going to come in on Sunday it's going to be very good news okay so this is going to be a, a restful but yet still wonderful week it's going to be a week where you are um, working on the positivity in your life the first half of the week is going to be a week of rest but yet still um, in the middle of the week you're going to realize that um, all the negative things that were said and the backstabbing and all that things it's actually coming to an end 
it's coming it's it's becoming to an end and it's healing and the universal angels are bringing because this week is a week of healing and they are bringing healing to, towards a certain aspect and certain situation in your life so this is going to be um, a very positive positive week Thursday is going to be a wonderful powerful day connect with Thursday Friday um, from Thursday um, coming on um, to um, Sunday it's going to be very positive because it's all about the love energies um, it's uh, it's 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 an easy healing on Thursday because whatsoever that was happening um, on Wednesday there became an an end to it and um, on Thursday the energy of love and the connection with family people of the past but it's more of a family situation the connection is here and um, as you look in the weekend you have an a, a, a fire but yet still a water so fire and water is always cleansing fire and water is always cleansing so some people are seeing their enemies people who have been not um, very positive towards them and and now they're coming to light people who weren't very positive towards them and it's coming out to light because you know you can always wear a mask but at sometimes of the the time or the the stage or the game the mask is going to be reveal and you will reveal yourself who you are okay so I always tell people you can wear the mask for as long as you think you can but the mask is always going to come off because you can't uh, um, keep a uh, keep a mask up all the time okay your message for this week it's going to be connecting with the beams I think um, I fully experience every moment of my life by living in the present so I fully experience every moment of my life by living in the present I fully experience every moment of my life by living in the present so this is the card I fully experience every moment of my life by living in the present and what do we have for the Aquarians from the funny deck the E energy we have bring it on bring it on okay so from uh, the consciousness it's the present so whatsoever you guys are doing and now I know why the present comes up is that in the two first days of the week uh, um, you need to have rest so I fully experience a moment in my life by living in the present so whatsoever is going on please live in the present um, do not um, be distracted and um, let anyone pull you away from uh, being in the present understand your journey and we have for the funny deck the e energy deck here is the e oracle the oracle of the e oracle of the energy wow you are a brave and fearless these days even if it doesn't feel that way you are being called to take off your armor and leap towards today is the day to call fear out as the rapid um, impulse that it is it's time to go for it wow this is this is extremely good this is this is wonderful this is extremely good so again it's wow you're brave and fearless these days even if it doesn't feel that way you are being called to take off your armor and leap towards to to today <laughs> is the day to call fear out and the rapid instantly so you know this is such a wonderful energy so because it's a good energy because it's saying you know relieve yourself from fear conquer fear and, and and put fear behind you because you know we all let fear 
kind of take over our lives and we need not to do that we need to stand up for our own and stand up for who we are okay and I want to say to each and every person please like share these videos please listen to your Sun moon and rising sign it is very 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 important and um, check out if the um, the July readings are up and remember to check out the third quarter readings which is July August and September that's all already upload okay I want to say namaste until next week